In this video, you will learn tools and techniques to help you design your mosaic. In mosaicing, there's lots of different kinds of tools. There's lots of different kinds of mosaicing, actually, but today we're really focusing on ceramic tile and found object kind of things. If you were going to be using glass, you would have a different set of tools, which would be a glass cutting tool and a nipper and a wheel cutter, but we're not going to use those today. Safety first, put your glasses on. I need to invest in some better looking glasses. These are really not very attractive, but I guess that doesn't matter. So to break your tile, um, you can use a rock if you don't have a hammer, or you can use a hammer. And the hammer's nice. You can use a piece of cloth in your hand like this, or you can wear a little brown uh, cloth glove. Or if you've been doing it for a long, long time like me, you just break it right in your hand. But I don't recommend that for beginners. So I'll try to be consistent with my cloth. Um, another thing to use is uh, the compound tile nipper, which makes your uh, tile nipping, breaking very easy. Um, instead of putting the, you really want to, people want to put the whole clipper on there and try and do it and it won't break like that. So the easiest thing to remember is to always just stick it right on the edge. It's just a tiny little snip. And this compound nipper has uh, a spring in it, so it doesn't take any effort at all. Even a really super weak person can do this with the tile nipper. So you can see how easy that is. Now, if you wanted to put mirror into your, um, into your piece, that does require cutting. And it's very simple. You can buy this tool at Home Depot. It's like just a cheap uh, glass cutter. There are I don't know, $5 or something. Or you can, if you're going to get really crazy and start doing a lot of it with glass, then you can get one of these expensive pistol grips, uh, or not pistol grips, but um, it's just a, a nice glass cutter, but these are about $40. So go for the basics. You just take it and you just do one score. You'll hear a little crunching noise. And then this is your breaker and it's got a little line on there. You line that up with the line on your glass and it just snaps it right in half. So these are fun to use, just little accents in your piece. So a great kind of adhesive to use that I use, it's really simple, most hardware stores and other stores uh, carry it. This is called GE Silicone Glue uh, Silicone 2. Um, another thing you can use is just a tile mastic. This is probably the most common thing, but you have to mix it up and it only comes in big bags. So when you're doing small projects, this is what I recommend. It's easy, it's easy to hold, you can close it up, use it later. It's the perfect thing to use, GE silicone glue. Up next, learn about how to design and build your mosaic. 